Okay, uh, Jaylee, you defend your uh, McLennan Ross Alberta Junior Tour Championship title. Uh, how does it feel? On, uh, feel on a tough, windy day here at uh, the famed Old Course. <laughs> Feels good because last year Duncan told me that no one's ever won three times in a row. So then I was like, okay, I got again. Go in the history books. <laughs> three in a row was fantastic, and and uh, you know you won a couple weeks ago as well. So are you really kind of finishing the summer strong? Do you feel? Yeah, I do. It started off a bit shaky because everyone wasn't really used to golfing, and then it starts to get better after that. <laughs> um, how do you kind of fight through a tough course in these windy conditions? Well, you kind of just got to go with it because I hit a lot of balls into the fescue, and then I just find it, play it safe, chip it close, tap it in for par. Uh, you make a nice bird in 18. Is, is it nice to finish that way? Yeah, it was because me and Jenna were tied going into the last hole, so we were both nervous, so then it felt really good to win that. I was just like, okay, hey, just put it close, and we'll go into a playoff. <laughs> Overall, what's the experience been like competing on this McLennan Ross Junior Tour, and any advice for anyone who, who wants to try this tour out? It's a really good tour to start off as, and like a lot of people are scared to start tournaments because like, there's a lot of good people playing. But like McLaren Ross, there's a lot of beginners, so then it's a good tournament to start. Great. Hey, thank you so much. Congratulations. Thank you. All right. Okay, Zach, uh, how does it feel to be the McLennan Ross uh, Alberta Junior Tour Champion, shooting 70 on a, on a tough, windy day at the uh, old course? Um, it feels really good. Um, y you know, really tough conditions today, a tough golf course with this wind, and you know, I've had a great year, and this kind of just adds <laughs> adds to the top of the the cake. So, yeah, I'm really I'm really happy. Uh, different course, but you were here at Wolf Creek for the Alberta Open yes. on the Lynx course, and and you were competing against professionals, yeah. and and you shot that 72 and 73 in the final two rounds, and now you're back here as champion. I assume when you look back on the summer, Wolf Creek will have a very special place in your heart. Oh yeah, for sure. Um, you know, the people here are just make it that much more special. Uh, Ryan, the kind of the owner, and then Aaron, the head pro, they just make this kind of place really magical, and ha have these all these different events here that. Um, I get to compete in it and everything, so I'm really grateful. And yeah, <laughs> Wolf Creek's going to be a very special place looking back on the year. Um, four wins on the uh, Maple Leaf Junior Tour, uh, and that must have given you confidence coming here to the McLennan Ross, uh, uh, you know, championship uh, finals. Uh, did, did that confidence carry over today? Uh, yeah, for sure. Um, winning winning four events in the MJT really helps coming here because I knew I knew lots of the kids here, but. For the, especially for the overall, I'm playing kids that are older than me. So, you know, winning this kind of just like, it's almost, it feels a bit better than the MJT because I'm beating like 17, 18 year olds. So yeah, I'm really happy. Overall, what will you look back on uh, this summer? You're 15 years old, yeah. uh, you, your game has really come of age. Um, it's it's playing under COVID protocols. Yeah. What, what will you remember most about this crazy summer? Well, as a, as a 15 year old, it's a good, tough transition year because it's going from shorter tees to longer tees. So the fact that I'm even doing this well as a 15 year old is really, well, for me, it's really impressive. And with all the, all the wins that I've had this year and all the great accomplishments, like tied for 20th at the Alberta Junior and um, tied for third at the Juvenile, and all that is just awesome. And what do you think people at your home club are going to say? Uh, I'm sure they'll be really happy. Um, they, they've kind of been following me all around, all, all my events, and somehow know all, looking up all my scores and stuff. So, yeah, I'm sure they'll be really pleased with how I, I've represented Mickelson National this year. Great. Thank you so much, Zach.